is up? I'm Moana Turtle. Today we have a pretty quick Unbroken Bonds opening. We have eight packs of Unbroken Bonds, uh, but really what I want to do is talk to you guys about the prospect of um, having PTCGO content and try to gauge the audience whether or not you guys will be interested in that and if so uh what kind of things do you feel like you would like to see um whether it's just like all right just you know play the meta event relevant decks do you feel like i should try to you know kind of brew and create some different stuff um for example i feel like people acknowledge that muck muck a muck is a good card but it's definitely not uh, super meta relevant, but maybe that's something you would like to see. And for our first, ooh, we do have something right away. Let's see what we got. Ooh, my champ, Marshadow. Pretty good. Another tag team. Actually, this card, I feel like I really don't give this card credit. But people have, I've heard people say that this thing's not too bad. Uh, and the reason is you don't really use it as your main Pokemon. Uh, however, it's just something that you can bring in when you when revenge is relevant and you don't need to worry about being knocked out next turn because it does have a lot of hp but right off the bat we got a tag team hit very strong opening so far um so yeah i just want to gauge take the the room and the temperature see what what kind of things you guys you think you would like to see uh so definitely let me know in a comment down below and uh actually let's focus on this opening so far we're we're, we're off to a very strong start. Then we got a Laron, Gliscor, Triple Acceleration Energy, nice. Glammeow, Growlithe, Ghastly, Togepi, Pikachu, Meltan for the reverse, and then, oh my gosh, and oh, there they are. there's the boys. Oh, I feel like in IRL, I could definitely make a Muck and Muck deck. I could definitely pull the uh, Gardevoir, Sylveon, um, actually, Pikachu's Ekrom too, and uh, yeah, I actually have enough Reshi Zards at this point in time. Uh, wow, what a fire opening. Two packs, two tag teams, very strong start. Um, yeah, let's see, what else about... Uh, so I definitely want to uh, definitely play the the best decks just to kind of make sure I do know the current meta and familiar with all the different mechanics. Uh, but then from there, you know, I, there's there's a lot of variety that to be had. Um, I still really like the Whimsicott card, um, so I feel like that one can definitely work. But uh, then oh, I feel like the other ones like Blacephalon and stuff like that. Um, at this point where I've already opened most of my like Lost Thunder and stuff, it'll be really hard. Genesec, we are the regular rare. Very hard to create some of those decks because uh, oh, I'll probably set aside... <laughs> Uh, a few of these codes for myself So for example this one um, But yeah, it'll be it'll take a little bit to put together a Blacephalon deck Whoa, 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 I think I just saw oh my gosh. This is crazy. All right. We already got two hits guys We only have eight packs here, and I feel like there's another one uh, Welder, that's a good card. Litten, Clefairy, Seal, Gligar Mistrevious, a surprise box, and then we have Oh, <laughs> we're pulling all the good cards. Oh my gosh, all the cards I want. My champ Marshadow, I feel like uh, I, I didn't give a, a fair chance. Uh, and oh, I love this one. The full art just looks amazing. Oh my gosh, this, is, this opening is insane. Um, whew. Lost my train of thought. But uh, yeah, if there's any like really cheap budget decks that don't require a lot of like ultra rares, definitely let me know what you what that is, because um, maybe that's a good place to start. Uh, but as far as what kind of cards I'll have, you know, obviously I've been opening a lot of unbroken bonds, so I feel like I the deck would have to be focused around the unbroken bonds cards, at least in the ultra rare slot. Uh, like I feel like from Burning Shadows, I don't I don't need too many cool cards. I just gotta get like a handful of Guzmas to and a Hypno regular rare um, to have those supporters. Some Cynthia's too. Uh, not sure which deck the Lily is in. Which which set? But I feel like Lily is kind of like the primary supporter. Which to be honest, I don't really understand. Um, so I feel like that one definitely isn't the strongest. Fire Crystal, that's a pretty useful card. De-Evolution Spray, Togetic, Aeron, Sandshrew, True, Ghastly, Tangela, Venonet, Cartana for the reverse, 
And, ooh, Mew. I feel like we've been pulling a bunch of these lately. Oh, I keep forgetting to set aside some code cards. Uh, but it's gotten to the point where I think um, I'll probably... I'm, I'm considering getting one of those uh, Island Guardian boxes. I'm actually, I'm not sure what the code card gives, but I, let me know if you have, have an idea what it, the right way to approach uh, getting the code cards is just to get a lot of the meta staples. Uh, here we have a Meowth with the plushes. Uh, for example, like the Reshi Zard box, pin collection box. Actually, it doesn't come out until like, I think August, so I'll probably need to. I would like to have everything done by then for sure, but that's probably the easiest time to get the Reshi Ram Charizard GXs. Uh, for his next pack, we have a Coughing and then a Wigglytuff regular rare. Alright, so we are on to our last pack, but that's okay. We don't need anything else. We already have three hits for this opening, uh, so that's very strong. Oh gosh, <laughs> I opened up eight packs. I meant to take like half, but I only saved two for myself. <laughs> Alright, we have Fighting Energy, Firo, Graveler, Metal Core Barrier, Froki, Crub Brawler, Oddish, Squirtle, Tentacool, a Koga's Trap Reverse. Uh, I haven't seen this card in a while, so I feel like this card kind of has fallen off. And then our last card is that Belly Pop Polyrath. Uh, so, very strong opening, and ooh. Two ultra rares plus a full art, and one of them's the boys. Definitely one of my favorites for sure. Actually, the whims got two. That was that was such amazing opening. Uh, really happy with the results. Uh, so let me know what are your thoughts below. What do you think you would like to see? Any tips for building my PTCGO account? Um, and yeah, let me know in a comment down below. Uh, also hit that like button and subscribe if you're not already. And thanks for watching, guys. I'm Moana Turtle. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.